Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday, December 31st. Ah, we made it. Kind of. We'll see. Who knows? Tomorrow will, could be exactly the same. Anyway, today is the last workout of 2020. We are going to kick 2020's ass. I'm saying ass on Zoom. Um, today's a lower body focus, focusing on the booty, showing we're going to moon 2020. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. <laughs> Um, you're going to need a mat, heavy weights, and your game face. Barb's wearing her summer shirt. Wear whatever you got to do to get it done. Let's do it. Our warm up today is our friend four on or 40, 30 on, 10 off, four exercises. And we'll get started soon. I'm going to show you what those exercises are and then we'll do it. So the first exercise is a side shuffle and a jump. So if you don't have room to do that, you can do a step touch that's wide and fast. Then we're gonna move into a slow squat. So slow on the way down and then stand up nice and quick. Then we're gonna move into a lunge and twist. You're gonna lunge with your arms out in front of you and twist to the leg in front. And then the last exercise, you can use a chair or something if you need balance. You're gonna hinge forward slightly and you're gonna push your leg out to the side. So it's like standing leg raises. All right, so we're waking up our glutes, waking up our legs, waking up our brains. Are we ready? We're gonna start with that side shuffle and jump in three, two, here we go. So shuffle, shuffle. If you cannot jump for whatever reason, you can do a little squat at the end. So a few shuffles to one side. Nice and low in your legs. Nice and quick. Big steps. Shuffle, shuffle, and jump. Good, get that heart rate up. Move the blood around. Two, one. All right, we're gonna go slow on the squat. So slow down, powerful up. You can hold the weight if you like or not. Here we go, two, one. So slow, slow. Slow pushes the feet, stand up really quick, squeeze your butt. Slow, 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 come up quick. So today, ladies, we are doing lower body, but this is the only squat we're going to be doing today. This is a squat-free workout. I don't know if that's good or bad news. Slow, 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 push up through the feet quick. Three, two, one. So that means that we're going to be doing a lot of lunging today. And we're going to move into our lunge and twist for a warm up. Three, two, here we go. Lunge back, keep that back knee up off the floor. Slow and controlled pause. Get your balance, connect with that front foot. And then twist to the leg in front. We're really focusing on that front foot. Really drilling that heel into the floor. Connect with that heel, connect with the glute. Two, one. All right, we're gonna do our standing leg lifts. So if you need to hold on to something for balance, you can, otherwise you're fine. Hinge forward slightly. Here we go, we're gonna push one leg slightly back behind and then the other. So those legs are straight. We're moving quickly, but with focus. From the side, it looks like this. You're pushing with the hip. Remember, ladies, the glutes are a push muscle group, so you're making a fist with your bum cheek, pushing that leg back behind you. Break up those glutes. Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna move into round two, side shuffle and jump. Also good news today, there's no conditioning. We're gonna do our conditioning in the workout. Here we go, side shuffle. I know some people really like the separate conditioning. Some people can take it or leave it. Today we're gonna to leave it in the workup. Shuffle, shuffle, jump. Nice big steps. Light on the feet. Oh my God, I walked here this morning and they plowed the roads, but I swear that makes them worse. I almost wiped out like five times. And rest. Yes, 
crazy. Little sheets of ice. All right, squatting slow, standing up with power. Here we go, slow, 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 push up. Good, sit nice and low into those hips, lean with your bum. Good, push up through those feet. Squeeze your bum at the top. Stretch out those glutes and then contract. Explode up through them, five. Three, two, awesome. Lunge and twist. Remember, we're focusing on that front leg, waking up the glute through the heel. Three, two, one. Lunge back, pause. Get your balance, then twist. So it's almost two exercises here. Lunge and then twist. It's not one exercise. So really focus on that balance. Get that back knee up. Good work. Relax your neck as your arms come up in front of you. Good. Three, two, one. All right. Exercise four is our standing leg lift. So remember, we're squeezing the bum. We're making a fist. Here we go. Push that leg back behind you. Squeeze the bum. Wake up those glutes. Remember, we're leading with the glute. You're leading with your heel. Push that leg up. Push, 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 push. Back is flat, chest is lifted. Neck is relaxed. Use your glutes. Push, push, push. Three, two, one. All right, got one more round of the warm up. If you're not warming up yet, I want you to pick up the pace a little bit. We're gonna do our side shuffle. Three, two, here we go. Shuffle, shuffle. Good work, everyone. Low in those hips. Little jump at the end, or a big jump if you're feeling spicy. Awesome work. Three, two, one. Beautiful. All right. Last squats of the class. Let's make them count. Nice and slow and low. Three, two. Here we go. Slow and low. Then pop up. Good work, everyone. Nice and slow. Nice and low. Keep your chest lifted, back is flat. Leave with your bum. Awesome work. Two, one. All right, lunge and twist. Waking up our abs, waking up our legs. Three, two, here we go. Slow and controlled, pause. Good, connect with that front heel. Shift that weight back into the hip. So that your leg is at 90 degrees. Nice work, relax your neck. Shoulders back and down. Awesome, all right, we've got one more exercise. Last chance to weave up your glutes. Really squeeze. Two. Here we go. Lean with the heel. Leg is straight. Push. 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 Good work. Good work. Squeeze. Ten seconds. With joy. Nice. Three, two, one. All right, grab a quick drink. Now I'm gonna explain to you what's happening. So we're gonna do a series of little circuits today. Each circuit is uh, 50 on, 10 off for each exercise. And how it's gonna work is we're gonna do the left leg, 
then the right leg, and then cardio. Yes? Now we're going to do each circuit twice. And I'm just going to show you the circuits as we get there. I'm not going to inundate you with a whole bunch of information up front. We'll just do the circuit and move on to the next one. So this first circuit we're doing twice back to back. Left leg, right leg, then cardio. I'll show you the movements and then we'll get started. So the first exercise is a three, two, one lunge. So you're going to step back as far as you can. You're going to pulse. Stay low in that leg, bring your knee closer. Stay low in the leg, bring that leg even closer and then come up. So three, two, one, stand up. We're going to stay on that one leg for 50 seconds, switch legs for 50 seconds. And then we're going to do our shuffle. So remember ladies, the shuffle can be straight shuffle. You can do a few jump lunges here and there. Or if you want to do straight jump lunges for 50 seconds, please be my guest. All right, let's get ready. So we're going to start in a few seconds. Pick up your heavy dumbbells. Ready? In three, two, one. Here we go. So you're going to lunge back as far as you can. You're going to sit into that hip. Tap your knee down. Tap your knee down. Stand up. Go for it. Find the rhythm. So remember, in these lunges, the front leg is the leg doing the work, and you want to keep the weight shifted back in the hip. So you're never overextending the knee, you're never going too far forward, you're always keeping your torso upright, and the weight shifted in the hip. Good. Pulse, pulse. Pulse. Keep that weight shifted in the hip. Drill that front heel into the floor. Two. Oh. Rest. Shake it out. We're going to switch legs. Remember the torso stays upright. Three, two, one. Here we go. Big step back. Sit into the hip. Bring the knee forward. Sit into the hip. Bring the other knee forward. Sit into the hip. Stand up. Good. Find the rhythm. Remember, we're keeping that weight back in the hip, in the front hip. Front heel is pushing into the floor. Good. Keep those shoulders back. Abs are engaged. Torso is upright. A few more seconds to go, ladies. We can do it. 10 seconds. Ooh, strong legs, strong legs. Three, two, one. All right, put those weights down. We're gonna do our shuffle. So you can shuffle as hard as you can. You can add a jump lunge. Whole body, arms and legs. Three, two, here we go. So we're light on the feet. Arms and legs are active. If you wanna throw, a couple of jump lunges in there, here and there. Please do. Good. Pump those arms. Shuffle those feet. Sit into that front hip in those lunges. You got it. Remember, there's no separate conditioning today. So you want to make these cardio intervals count. Good work. Three, two, one. All right, we only got 10 seconds here. Pick those weights up. Three, two, one, lunge. Here we go. Step back. Pulse. Pulse. Stand up tall. Good. So the key here is to take as big of a step back as you can so you have lots of room to move forward. If you cut yourself off too early in that initial lunge, there's not a lot of traveling room. Good. So remember, we're only doing each circuit twice, and this is the last time you have to do these today. So work with them. Sit back in that front hip. Good. And relax. Switch legs. Shoulders back. Check your posture. Three, 
two, here we go, big step. Tap, tap. Remember that tap, you're sitting back into the hip. You're not pulsing forward in the knee. So make sure that huge hip joint takes the brunt of these lunges, not your little knee joint. Your little knees do enough. They don't need to hold up your body weight. So shift that way back into the hip. Good. Shift, shift, shift. Ugh. 10 seconds, team, 10 seconds. Nice work. Two, one, all right, 10 seconds, then we get to shuffle again. Make this as big and as exaggerated as you can. Get that heart rate up. Yeah, here we go. Add those shuffle jump lunges if you like. Otherwise, keep moving. Whole body. Good work. Pump it up, pump. You can do it. Woo. 15 seconds. Then we get a break. Go right to the end. Three, two, one. Whew. All right, keep moving, grab a quick drink. In other news, this class is also burpee free. Burpee free, squat free. All right, our next circuit, our friend the curtsy. So you're gonna shift back, sit back, bend both knees, Sit into the front hip, push up. So do that on one leg, then the other. Then we're gonna do some skaters. So nice and wide, if you cannot jump, step touch, explosive, fun, sweaty. All right, here we go. If you cannot do curtsies, please do a regular reverse lunge instead. We're on in six. Shoulders back, pick up your dumbbells. Big wide stance, here we go. Sit into the front hip, stay on that same leg. Push up through the front heel. Sit low, make sure to bend both knees, that's super important. Sit into the front hip, connect with the front heel, push up with the front heel. So when you sit down, you're stretching out your glute, then you contract it to push yourself back to standing. Good work. Remember, if you cannot curtsy, you can do a regular reverse lunge instead. Good work, good work. Nice work, shoulders back. Two, one. Whew. All right, adjust your posture. We're gonna do that on the other leg. Four, three, two, here we go. Yes. Sit into that hip. I don't know about you, but my legs are a bit tired from Tuesday still. We worked really hard. So if your legs are feeling tired, just work through it. Do your best. Good, sit into the hip. Push up through the heel. Bend both knees. And remember, only go as deep as your hips and knees allow. Check your posture. Are your abs helping you? They need to be, that's their job. Pull your belly button in, shoulders back. Whew. Push up through that heel. Two. One, all right, weights down. Olympic medal round, speed skating. Whew. Here we go, two, one. Big hops. Remember, if you cannot jump, nice low 
Step touch. If you want to add more to this, make that back leg fully up. Try and touch the ground with your hand. Use your arms. Get a good rhythm going. Remember, this is your cardio conditioning. Push yourself a little bit extra. You got it. Chest lifted. Back is flat. Go, right to the end, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, all right. Quick breather. Pick your weights back up. Right into those curtsies. Two, here we go. Bend both knees. Sit into that hip. Push up through your front heel. Nice. Good work. Hips and heels. How's your posture? How are those glutes feeling? Good work, ladies. You can do it. Strong and fit. Keep it up. All these muscles are so helpful with our outdoor winter activities. Let's keep them strong. Four, three, two. Ooh. Shake it out. We're going to switch legs. Nice work, everyone. Three, two. Here we go. Sit into that hip. Strong legs. Strong glutes, you can do it. Nice work, everyone. Stay strong, stay focused. Good work, good work, 20 seconds. Check your posture, lengthen on the top of your head. Hips and heels. <sighs> nice. Almost there. Two, one, beautiful, all right. Let's skate. Last time with this exercise, quick and powerful. Two, one, here we go. Use your whole body, arms included. Land in the hip, push up through the heel. So your whole foot is in contact with the floor, not just your toe. Get your heel down, explode back up through it. You got it. Woo. Almost there, 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Woo! Nice work. All right, keep moving, grab a drink. <sighs> moving on to circuit three. So we're doing five circuits today. So the next one, you have two options for the lunge. Option one, you're gonna lunge back and drive up to that leg that's on the floor. Bring that knee up. That's option one. Option two is the big next level. You're gonna push through the front leg to standing. So catch and push. So you're going forward and pushing up. This one you're going back, pushing up. The other one you go forward. And push up. Either way, the front leg does the work. Then we're going to do a fun one. Can can jacks. Huge movements today. Take that, 2020. We're going to take up all the space. All right, so you've decided. Do you want to do forward lunges or backwards lunges? 
You don't need weights for these ones. All right, ladies. Three, two, one. Here we go. Lunge. Push yourself up. So I'll do backwards lunges this round for demonstration purposes. And then I'll do forward ones next round. If you have bad knees, always lunge back. So the leg that's on the floor, the leg in the front, that's the working leg. The leg in the back's just there for decoration and balance. So that back leg doesn't do any work. It's all the leg in the front. So explode up through that front leg, front hip. Bring your knee up. Good. Two. One, Whew. this is a good stress reliever, but really drive that knee forward. Three, two, other leg, here we go. Remember the front leg does the work, the stationary leg. Bring that knee forward, explode up through the hip. I love these, they're super effective. Easy, you don't need any equipment. And like I said, we're good for that stress. Get that knee up, explode through the hip. If you need to hold on to something for balance, please do. I'd rather you hold on to something than flail around without good form through the movement. Good work. Three, two, oh. all right, can can jacks are next. So jacks with the arms, can can with the legs. Here we go. This is a funny one. Try and keep your torso upright. So you're not like this. Your can can dancer, long legs, proud posture. Good. Shoulders back. Lengthen on the top of your head. You got it. Find a rhythm. If jumping's not your friend, take the jump out. 10 seconds. Pick it up a little bit. Four. Three, two, woo. All right, team. Round two. I'm gonna do the forward lunge this time. See how my knees like it. Here we go, forward. Push up off the front leg. Forward. If that doesn't work for you, I invite you to just go back to the reverse lunge. I'm going to, because that actually hurts my knee to go forward. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna step back, explode up through the foot that's on the floor. You're welcome to try the forward lunge if your knees are okay with that. Mine are not. Sit back into the hip, push into the floor, push up tall. Two, one. Good work, ladies. All right. Last time on the other leg. Check your posture. Two, here we go. Good, sit back into the hip. Explode up. Push into the heel. Squeeze your bum cheek. Nice. You are awesome. You have strong legs. You can do this. Good work. Almost there. Squeeze that bum cheek at the top. Engage the hamstring. Good. Four. Three. Two, woo. All right, 
right, take it out, Ken, Ken, Jackson, next. Big movement. Ham it up. This is it. Here we go. Check your abs. Shoulders back. Enjoy yourself. Have fun. Good work, good work. 30 seconds. You can do it. Remember, there's no conditioning today. This is it. Pick it up. 15 seconds. The sweat is dripping off my face. Hopefully, there is this too. Five, four, three, two. Whew. All right, grab a drink. <sighs> Keep moving. <sighs> That's a good one. All right. Next round. Once again, you have two options for the strength. So the first option, they're both side lunges. Option one, no dumbbells. So you're going to take a big step to the one side, sit into your hip, push up through the hip, open yourself up. So this one gets a double whip when you sit into it, push up and extend. That's option one. Option two, dumbbells. You're gonna take a big step, sit into the hip, push yourself back to standing. So no arms, no extension. Then our cardio is a pop squat. So you have a couple options, you can stay low, or you can pop up. Yes? All right. So I'm going to demonstrate the heavy lunge first with my dumbbell. All right. So pick up your weights. We're going to pick up our right foot. Step to the right. Here we go. Sit into your hip. Push up through your heel. Hip. Heel. Hip. Heel. Make sure that foot is pointing to the front of the room and that you're sitting into your hip. You're engaging your heel with the floor, exploding up through that heel. Sit and push. Catch in the hip. Push up. Catch and push. Really focus on that hip and the heel. You're leading with the side of your foot. 10 seconds. <laughs> Three, two, one. Beautiful. All right, shake it out. We're going to do the exact same thing on the other side. So your right foot stays stationary. Pick up your left. Here we go. Sit into the left hip. Push up through the left heel. Lead with the side of your foot. Catch yourself and push. Chest is lifted. Remember the hips do the work, not the knee. Whew. Good work, good work. Sit into the hip. Push up through the heel, you got it. Ah. Catch and push. 15 seconds. Good work, good work. Three, two, one. All right, our cardio conditioning. Open and close jump squats. You can stay low or pop up. Three, two, let's do it. So it can look like this or it can look like this. If you cannot jump, it looks like this. Nice and quick and powerful team. Get it done. Push, push, push. 
Good work, good work. Yes. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. All right, this time we're gonna demonstrate the other variation of the lunge. You don't need weight. All right, you wanna do the other one, you can. Here we go, to the right. Sit into the right foot. Push up with the right leg. Extend the right leg. You can add your arms if you like. Sit into the right hip. Push up through the right hip. Extend the right leg. Ooh. Push yourself up. Push yourself open. These are way more challenging after doing the weighted ones first. That's for sure. Almost there. Two, one. Good work, side bone. All right, other side. Three, two, here we go. Hit left hip, left heel. Really push open. Lift, squeeze that bum cheek, lift the leg just like we did in the warm up. Catch and push. Remember, you can act your arms if you like. Sit into the hip, push up through the heel. Good work. Keep that weight shifted backwards. Save your knees. Good work. Three, two, one. Woo All right, we're gonna burn out those blue knees. That's the side of your bum. Open close jump squats. Two, one, here we go. And then we got one more circuit. And then, booty bonanza. Open and close. Quick and powerful. Get that heart rate up. You got it. Go, 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 go. Fifteen seconds. Low and high. Light on the feet. Three, two, one. All right, keep moving, grab a drink. We got one more circuit. And then our booty bananas at the end. So this last circuit is a Romanian deadlift, so straight-legged deadlift. You're gonna do it with one leg. Few options. Option one, hinge, come back up. Option two, this leg is here to help, but the other leg still does all the work. Stick your bum out, back is flat. So one leg and then the other, and then we're gonna finish it off with some swings. If you cannot swing, you can do a fast weighted sumo instead. All right, pick a leg, any leg. The leg you're working is straight. The other leg is there for help. If you need it, here we go. Hinge, back is flat. Leg that's working stays straight. Keep those dumbbells tight to your body. So those dumbbells raise your legs on the way up and on the way down. Bum goes straight back. This is where we tell 2020 what we really think of it. It's my bum. Hinge, back is flat, leg is straight. Feel the tightness in the hamstring. Don't worry about touching. 
touching the floor. Only go to where you feel the hamstring tighten. Two, one, excellent. All right, we're gonna switch legs. So other leg is straight. Three, two, here we go. Everything else stays the same. Bum goes straight back, back is flat. Dumbbells are touching your legs on the way down and on the way up. Hinge. Good. So imagine your body is a door hinge. You hinge to 90, then you open the door. Feel the stretch in the hamstring, that's your cue to engage. Imagine that you're pulling the back of your knee to the bottom of your bum cheek. That's the connection. Back of the knee, pull up to the bottom of the bum cheek. Two, one, beautiful. All right, pick up your heaviest dumbbell or kettlebell if you have them, hold on nice and tight. We're gonna do some swings. Here we go, sit back, swing forward. So remember this is like a pelvic thrust. You can bend the knees slightly, then straighten the knees, or you can hinge and pop up. Remember to squeeze your bum at the top. That's the action. So this is not coming from your back or your arms. It's coming from your hips. Sit back, hinge forward. Sit back, hinge forward. Squeeze your bum at the top. You should feel the backs of your legs for sure, especially after all those lunges we just did. Hinge, pop up. Three, two. All right, we're gonna do that all again. Woo. So single leg, straight leg and deadlift. Here we go. Leg is straight. Stick the bum straight back. So that other leg is there for balance. You're just up on your toe. Or if you're a champion and you can extend that leg back behind you, please do that. I cannot do that. So I opt for this one instead. I want to keep my form on point. Shoulders back. Stick your bum straight back. Remember you're pulling the back of your knee to the bottom of your bum cheek. Tightness in the hamstring, that's where we feel it. Two, one, beautiful. All right, shake it out, we're gonna switch legs. So left leg is straight or other leg, whatever leg you started on, other leg's bent. Here we go. Hinge, back of knee to bottom of bum cheek. Pull them together. Good work, good work. Push that foot into the floor. Keep those dumbbells close to your body. Remember, we're only going to 90 degrees or parallel with the floor. Don't worry about touching the floor. That's just going to round your back. Awesome work, everyone. Stay focused. 10 seconds. Bottom of bum cheek, back of knee. Pull them together. Two, one. Woo. All right. Swings to the last in our circuit. Then we're going to come down to the floor for our glute burnout. Here we go. Let's swing. Remember the legs can be straight in an identical movement to what we just did. Or you can bend the knees and then straighten the knees. If the swing hurts your back, you can do a quick sumo instead. Good. Strong legs, strong legs. You got it. Halfway there, we're so close. Check your glutes at the top. Squeeze. Four, 
four, three, two, one. All right. Yay, we made it. All right. Here comes the best part. Now we're going to do a booty bonanza. So we are going to do five exercises and we're going to do them all on one leg. Then we're going to switch and do them all on the other leg. Yes, Barb, I can tell you're really impressed. Okay, so I'll show you the exercises real quick and then I'll show them to you again as we get through it. The first one is a rainbow kick. So you're going to extend your leg, you're going to bring it to one side, bring it up and across in a rainbow shape, like so. Then the next one, same leg, hydrant, like a dog peeing, to kick and down. Hydrant, kick. Then the next one, you're going to be on your tummy. You're going to bend your knee and you're going to do a single leg push. You can also do a single leg super person. Then you're going to flip onto your back for the last two. Same leg, single leg bridge. And then the last one is a single leg bridge hold. So we just hold it the whole time. Yes? All right, so we're gonna do it all on one leg, then all on the other leg, and that's it. So your bums are gonna be so excited about this, I think. We're gonna do the same format, 50 on, 10 off, five exercises. So come on down to the floor. We're gonna start in that tabletop position with the rainbow kick. Ready. Here we go. Three, two, one. So you're going to extend that leg back behind you. You're going to keep it extended and reach it around behind and in a rainbow shape. You want to keep your glute extended and contracted the whole time. So there's going to be points in the rainbow, i.e. up to the side, where your glute wants to relax. Don't let it. You also want to try and keep your back and pelvis neutral. So this one's slow and controlled. The movement comes from the glute. Make a fist with your glute and keep that fist engaged. Squeeze. Bring that leg up and across. Hold on to that contraction. Bring it back the other way. Hold on to that contraction. Three, two, one, all right, same leg, hydrant to kick. So reset your tabletop. There we go, two, one. You're gonna push your leg up like a dog peeing, and then you're gonna extend your leg, bend your knee, bring the leg back down. Knee, kick, knee, down. So hydrant, push the knee up. Use the glute to keep the knee lifted. Extend the leg. Then slowly lower the leg. So contract your glute, connect with your glute. We've got lots of time and lots of reps with this one leg. So make friends with it. Find your glute, use it. Push that leg up. Remember the glute is a push muscle. So you wanna push. Three. Two, one. All right, you're gonna come down onto your tummy. You're gonna bend that one leg, the one we've been working. And now you're gonna push your pelvis into the floor and lift that knee like two inches. So it's coming from the glute. If that doesn't work for you, you can squeeze your bum and use a Superman leg. So your leg is extended, but you're just doing the one leg. One bum cheek. So either way, this is a very small movement. You're not using your back. You're not arching at all. In fact, you should be able to put your hand on your lower back and not feel a contraction or feel a very subtle one. So you're using your glute. Making a fist with your bum cheek and you're pushing your pelvis into the floor and lifting your knee like an inch. It's not a big movement. Four, three, Two, beautiful. You're gonna flip onto your back. Same leg. 
You can cross the other leg over it in a figure four. Here we go. You're going to push your foot into the floor, squeeze your bum, single leg bridge. Lift and lower. So this one has movement. Squeeze and lift. Push the foot into the floor. Good. One leg. So we usually do these with two legs. Today we're doing one. Push your foot into the floor. Push your pelvis into the air. Contract. Good work. Your leg that's crossed over is adding a bit of weight. Stretching out the other hip. Good work. Squeeze and push. You got it. Seconds away, ladies. Push. How's that one bum cheek doing? Three, two, rest. All right, now we're going to do that same leg, single leg bridge. You're going to push it up into the air and hold it. Three, two, here we go. Squeeze, hold. Push your foot into the floor, contract. I'm going to try and hold this the whole time. If you need to come down and shake it out, do that. Remember, this action comes from the glute, not the back. So really think about the back of your leg. Think about your bum cheek. Go to your happy place. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Show that bum who's box. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Oh my God. 15 seconds, you can do it. Ooh. 10 seconds. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Four, three, two. Oh. All right, nice work. Woo. All right, grab a quick drink. We're going to switch legs. Nice. All right, equal treatment. That was actually quite enjoyable. But I'm a bit of a weirdo, so. <laughs> All right, we're going to do that all on the other leg now. So come into that tabletop position. We're going to start with that rainbow kick. So remember the glute does the work. You want to keep the glute contracted the whole time. Here we go, extend the leg, out to the side, up and over. Use your glute. Slow and control, leg is straight. Good work, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Good. You got it. Tabletop position, nice neutral pelvis. Pull your belly button in, keep that glute on. I know in that side movement, your glute wants to relax. Don't let it. Hold that leg up. Hold that leg up. You got it, we're almost there. Three, two, one, all right, reset your tabletop. We're gonna do that hybrid to kick. Three, two, one, here we go. Hydrant, extend, hydrant, down. Remember, the lifting of that knee comes from the glute. So you're pushing your knee up and you're holding the leg up with the glute, extending the leg. All from the bum cheek, not your back, not your hip flexor, your glute. Really focus in on those nice, big, strong muscles back there. Good work. Push. Three, two, one, all right. We're gonna come down onto our tummies. Ooh. Extend the legs, you're gonna bend the one knee. Push the pelvis into the floor, lift that knee an inch, if that. So you're squeezing the bum cheek, lifting the leg. Remember, if you need to straighten that leg, you can. You're gonna do a single leg super person. So you're still squeezing from the glute. Pushing the pelvis into the mat. Pushing the foot into the air. Contract that glute. Head and neck are neutral. So you're looking down at the ground. Back 
is relaxed. The only thing that moves here, ladies, is that glute. Four, three, two, yes. All right, we're gonna flip over onto our back. Single leg bridge. Here we go. Cross that leg over. Ooh. Push the active foot into the floor. Lift and lower. Push and lift. Slowly lower. Make sure that heel is the action point. Squeeze and lift. Remember, make that fist. Yes. You got it. Almost there. Four, three, two, one. All right, relax for this 10 seconds. We've got one more exercise. We're gonna squeeze and lift and hold, and then we'll do some stretching. Here we go. Two, one, squeeze and lift. Hold it, contract the glute. Focus in on the back of the leg and the glute. Hold that body up, you can do it. Squeeze, remember if you cramp up and you need to, you can shake it out, then resume as quickly as you can, squeeze. You got it. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Strong glutes. Ah, 15 seconds. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, yeah. All right, friends. Let's bring our knees into our chest. You can gently rock back and forth, massaging your lower back, taking a minute here. Breathe. Good, bring your knees towards your chest. Give yourself a really strong hug, make yourself a little ball. Now we're gonna extend our arms and legs, make yourself as big as possible, wiggle your fingers and toes. Good. Bend your knees, put your feet on the floor. You're going to bring your right ankle across your left knee. And then just reach up and bring both your knees towards you, stretching out your glute. Awesome. Switch legs. So left ankle on right knee. And then pull both knees towards you. And that is it for today. Woo! Good work, ladies. Thank you for being here. Happy New Year, everyone.